Just checking on uh, our big articulating four-wheel drive tractor. He's disking this field. This is some custom work. Our neighbors, uh, we bail all their hay for them. They don't own any equipment anymore. We Well, we pretty much, they irrigate. Other than that, we do the rest. But uh, this is our biggest tractor we have. We really don't pull a whole lot of big equipment with it. This is sort of the biggest uh, implement being the disc, the offset disc. Um, I guess 20, 24 foot wide. We do pull a land plane with this tractor and we pull a big ripper. That ripper does pull pretty hard. We will break uh, shear bolts, shear pins. Um, but it is a it is a big ripper and this disc is pretty good size, but our fields are so small, there really isn't a need for um, for a real big disc. Our biggest field is 130 acres, so it's hard to justify a, a, a real big disc um, <laughs> when everything's pretty small and there's a lot of turns involved. Especially um, disking between borders. If we don't want to take a field all the way out 100%, we will disc between the borders. So I'm just checking on this guy. He's a new driver. Um, I noticed this morning he wasn't picking that up as he was turning. And every now and then this disc is set up. It's offset to turn left. Um, he uh, <laughs> he was making some right-hand turns earlier. We had to tell him, hey, only left. But uh, I said he knew how to drive, but I don't know. Sometimes guys say that. But he's doing pretty good. Just checking on him. This field's going to go back into uh, alfalfa, um, which is a whole other topic of having um, rotation crops. Uh, because this isn't our field, it, it's just going alfalfa to alfalfa to alfalfa. It won't, it's not been anything else, and that's why we started putting sedan grass in our alfalfa, because it does act as some sort of a rotation these guys are just going to go back to back alfalfa, which it's okay. It'll it'll be all right. It'll be all right. Not a very big field. Sixty acres or so with a house on it. And uh, my neighbors, they're irrigating. Well, the neighbors there, these guys are irrigating, there's their tilt water. <clears throat> Anyways, uh, yeah, just driving around checking on stuff, fairly slow Saturday. They didn't bail any alfalfa this morning. We've got three loads of Bermuda to move. Cade is, Cade's moving that this uh, right now. So I'm just checking on stuff. Making sure guys are doing what they're supposed to do. We farm, I guess you could say we farm a little different over here compared to like the Midwest where a lot of those farms are, are owner operated. Um, my, my daddy rarely, very rarely drives tractors anymore. I used to spend a lot of time in tractors and even myself, I don't spend as much time. I'm in a squeeze a lot, so I am operating something, but uh, not a whole lot of tractor work anymore. I used to run the baler or the rake a lot. I've run that tractor a lot. I've put a lot of hours in that disking and uh, lasering. Which lasering is very different to you guys. Uh, whenever we start running that laser, I'll show you. My neighbors, uh, they're, they're lasering right here. They've got two. They've got two tractors going at the same time. Maybe we'll go jump in with Todd and see if he can tell us about the GPS system. It's always interesting. <laughs> 